The next election to be held on May 18th is going to be very important to the Australian people on who you put in that parliament. The future of our country, future generations, our debt, the economy, so important. I've worked extremely hard for you on the floor of parliament. I've managed to get jobs here, accountability from the government, many other things that I've, I've been able to achieve, not only for Queensland, but for the rest of Australia. In this election, Clive Palmer is vying for a seat himself in the Senate in Queensland, plus other seats he's sending candidates in. Oh, the man who's out there boasting, I want to make Australia great. Well, I've got a few questions to ask you, Clive. Why haven't you paid the Australian workers that worked in your nickel refinery from Townsville? You sent those families to the wall. A lot of people have suffered because of that. Why are you getting your call flutes made overseas in China? You say you want to make Australia great. Why isn't the money staying here in Australia? I can give you the names of some printers here. They'd love your business. You've already spent 31 million on advertising. You expect to pay, spend at least 80 million, but the money's going overseas. Is that going to make Australia great, Clive? What about your, your offshore company that you sent over to New Zealand and then you threatened to actually sue the government for loss of profits? What, to over $40 million, $45 million? Wasn't it something like that, Clive? Or what about the airstrip in Western Australia? Is that on your land? And honestly, will Chinese planes be able to land there? Oh, we can throw promises around and tell everyone we're going to do all these great things. Really, are you? I don't think so. And what annoys me that I've actually worked with both the Liberal and the Nationals and the Labor Party. I've worked with them in a constructive way on the floor of parliament but they are not prepared to actually talk to me, apart from the National Party, to talk to me about preferences, but they're sucking up to Clive Palmer for preferences. There is so much BS that goes on in that floor of parliament. You have no idea. Do you think that Clive Palmer or any of his candidates are going to give you accountability and try and deal with the bastards in there that are really screwing the Australian people over and future generations? I don't think so. Please think carefully when you cast your vote about who's really going to fight for you and what we need to change in this country. Please think carefully.